Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kubra, also known as It's Miss K. Thank you so much for tuning in. For all my returning subscribers, you already know about one. Thank you so much for coming back. For my new ones, thank you so much for joining me onto my financial journey. Y'all, I cannot wait to get over this intro because I got news for y'all. Okay, so your girl is officially monetized here on YouTube. God is so good. I'm super excited, y'all. Whew. Okay, I told myself this video was not gonna be too long because you already know it'd be long sometimes. So, y'all, I just wanna thank God. Like, I am so grateful. Like, it's crazy because I didn't think I could do it. I'm not gonna lie. I'm the first person to be doubting myself. So, this is, remember how I spoke it into existence like a few weeks back? Alhamdulillah, I'm so grateful. I am finally monetized. So, y'all, y'all are gonna be seeing as of my YouTube videos now. I am so excited. So that's what's going on. That's one thing. And um, today my cash stuffing is going to be a little bit different. I also have some happy mail, which is something I want to do right away. Okay. So I recently got some goodies from Brianna. She goes by Brianna Life and Budget here on YouTube. So I'm excited. Uh, I'm going to leave everything linked below. So I got myself, hold on, let me open this up. I got myself a tumbler that has its miski on it because I really wanted one that was like customized to uh, my brand and stuff and y'all um can you guys see i'm excited because you guys already know it's hot out here i want to make sure there's no information i don't want to mess anything up okay so i'm good to go but yeah it came super fast too y'all oh and i chose pink of course so we got the tumbler yay we got the tumbler i'm super excited <gasps> Look, y'all. Okay, wait, let me unra unravel it. Oh, thank you so much, honey. It comes with this super cute, uh, what's it called? Plastic thingy? Y'all, this tumbler is actually the cutest. <gasps> wow, look at the vinyl. I'm about to drink my water now, y'all. I love it so much. This is like my first It's Miss K product thingy that I can use for myself. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, love. Okay, so that's one. Oh, I love the pink, y'all. You guys already know it's gonna it's gonna match my nails, right? The ones I had like a few months back. I love it. But you know what I'm in love with? This right here. The vinyl. I love the rose gold. Can you guys see? But the camera's not even doing it justice. Oh, I'm in love. Okay, so next we have. I got I also got a t-shirt. So the t-shirt, I'm gonna show you. Ooh. Hold on, yeah. I got a, a bigger size because I kind of wanted to just use it to lounge around my house. So, yes. Oh, I love the vinyl. It's super cute. So it says, you already know I'm a cash stuff in it. So it says, cash stuffing mama. Can you guys see? Cash stuffing mama. And then, like the vinyl is kind of like a rose gold too. I love the color. I don't know if you guys can see the full thing. Hold on. Simply because my camera is super close to my table. I love this. Oh, first of all, this t-shirt is super soft. I love it. So I got it in an XL so I can just go ahead and lounge around with. But I'm in love. But you guys can, you guys want to see the best part? The best part is this right here. It's Miss K. Y'all, I'm into everything customization lately. Like, I love having It's Miss K everywhere. Look at this. I love it. Oh, thank you so much, Han. I am super happy. And I think there's a few things in here. Oh, I got stickers. You already know how I feel about my stickers. Cash stuffing mama. Yes, I love it. And hold on. There's like a thank you card. I think more stickers. Okay, into here. Oh, what does it say? Proud small business supporter. I love it. I love it so much. This is so cute. I'm probably going to be, yeah, I'm going to be putting this onto my laptop. I love how the Cash Stuffing Mama also matches um, her brand and her, her design on the t-shirt. That's super cute. Thank you so much, Brianna. Love, I'm going to be putting these stickers onto my laptop. You already know I'm about to drink my water. I'm about to drink that H2O and I'm about to be lounging around in this oversized t-shirt and there's a thank you card. Ooh, I like that. Let's see. Wait, I don't know if I can read it to y'all. Let me see. Oh, hold on. Let me see. I'm going to go ahead and read it to y'all. So it says, 
Thank you so much, love. You're amazing. No, hon, you're the one that's amazing. I hope you like your t-shirt. When you wash it, wash it inside out. Oh, thank you for the note, girl, because I was going to just put it into the washer. I wash it the way it was. So now I know that after I'm done wearing it, I'm going to go ahead and do it inside out. I have to admit, um, on the IG and stuffing, I did not remove the piece of vinyl. Girl, I didn't even notice. I love it. <laughs> um, so I'm so sorry. I hope you still like it. Let me know. Let me see it. I didn't even notice that there was a piece missing or there was a vinyl somewhere. Oh, I think it's this here. Girl, this is nothing. I actually add style to it. But thank you so much, Brianna. I really, 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 really love this. I'm so happy. No wonder this is called Happy Mail. Like, I haven't done an unboxing in forever. So this is so exciting. I love the material, though. This is so soft. And because, y'all, it's hot here in Canada. So this material is definitely going to come in handy. So y'all, if you're trying to get a t-shirt that says Cash Stuff Mama, Brianna also has more designs. She has the le leopard, I think it's called leopard design. So yeah, make sure you check out her website. I'm going to be leaving her website as well as her channel, her YouTube channel linked in the bio. But yeah, I'm in love. I cannot wait. I'm going to be sipping on, on my sippy cup. This is going to be my new sippy cup. But yeah, it's Miss K everywhere. Ew. Thank you so much, love. And these stickers, you guys already know I love stickers because I also put stickers into my orders. So I'm going to be putting this into onto my laptop. But Brianna, love, thank you so much for packaging my order with care and for putting so much thought into it. I really appreciate you. Oh, my money's right here. Just poking out. So I'm going to go ahead and put my goodies to the side. I'm in love, y'all. I love the sippy cup. Oh, okay. So today I'm going to be stuffing. Guess what, y'all? I'm not going to be stuffing my 9 to 5 income um, today. Something came up, so we're not going to be doing that. But I did go ahead and decide to stuff my small business income. I'm like, you know what? That's something I've been putting off for a long time. I've been having so many videos I wanted to film, but I'm like, you know what? This is going to be a good time and opportunity for me to stuff it. So that being said, um, this money is the money that I made from my cash envelopes. Like, you know, the, the first release I ever had as well as my budget budgeting sheets. So I'm going to be stuffing a total of $405. And this is after all the website fees. Um, you already know Shopify takes their own fee, um, the payment fees, all the transactions fees, and all the shipping fees as well. So um, $405 is how much I'm going to be stuffing. I'm excited because you guys have yet to see my envelopes for my business categories, which is what you get to see today. But yeah, y'all, I guess I can talk a little bit as I go through this whole process. But your girl is officially monetized. Y'all, I'm shocked, okay? But alhamdulillah, I'm just super grateful. I want to thank each one of you that takes the time to be supporting me, watching my videos, liking, commenting. Because y'all, like, I, I never thought I'd be here um, so soon, y'all. Like, I, if you know, you know that I had to restart my whole journey. All my hours got expired. Uh, because I took a long break from YouTube, so they got expired, and I had to restart my whole YouTube journey from start, but I'm super happy I did. And you know what, y'all? I'm super happy, like, I left my shell, and, like, I explored more, you know, because I was so shy. I'm like, I don't know if I should come back on YouTube, and I'm so grateful that I had the support system that I had, because, like, you know, sometimes, you know, you can be your worst enemy by, you know, putting yourself in between you and your success, you know? So, you girls out here now being more um jolly and more open and all that good stuff but yeah thank you so much y'all so yeah i guess i would really appreciate it yeah if you guys were to watch my ads now <laughs> that's actually hilarious that i'm saying that lord have mercy all right so we're gonna be putting the money in here so 405 dollars and you know what's crazy um i have this thought in my head i'm like you know what Whatever money I make from my business, I'm going to simply reinvest it into my business to kind of scale it up. But to be honest, after I watched all my Frills video, she really inspired me to pay myself. It doesn't matter how much it is, y'all. I'm gonna be putting I'm going to be putting a little bit of money to the side for myself. So I decided to use that money to stuff some portions of my sinking fund. So that would be how I would be paying myself, right? So if that makes sense, first and foremost, we're gonna go ahead and stuff my business binder. So if you don't know, my business binder is also where I put in my savings challenges. So this is where I put in my saving challenges as well as my business um, expense envelopes, I guess. So let's go ahead and open this up. So in this video, I'm not going to be stuffing any of my saving challenges. Um, yeah, no. So you guys are going to see, but I'm probably going to be stuffing these probably next week or so whenever I do stuff my 9 to 5 paycheck. 
So we're skipping all the seven challenges, y'all. All of them, they get skipped today. So we're gonna start with taxes. I, I think this is your first time seeing this, so let me just go through this real quick. So these are my current categories for my sticky funds in terms of my business. So I have taxes, I have inventory, um, I have savings, I also have yearly fees as well as supplies. And then when I was doing my budget, I realized I forgot to add a few more categories that I feel like I should add. But when I tried to print out my envelopes, listen, my printer gave out on me, so it did not look good whatsoever. So I kind of had to go ahead and simply use these envelopes right here. Remember y'all, I did say I had samples and the samples were the ones that had a bunch of errors. So I simply went ahead and used these samples. Um, these are not my current envelopes that I sell. These are just the original samples that I had. I feel like I gotta put a huge emphasis on that because this is not the right product, right? But that being said, I'm going to be using this until my printer works or until I print out these envelopes. I really wanted to keep the silk team for my um whole cash stuffing so that's why i wanted to go ahead and print out the rest but that being said i've also added customs i've added marketing and i've also added giveaway all right so these are the categories i added last minute but that's okay i'm going to go ahead and adjust that later so that being said y'all let's go ahead and stuff our business envelope first of all we have taxes let me grab my pen Taxes, y'all, you already know a lot of us have like a love and hate relationship for it. The money we'll be putting away, y'all, it's not small. But that being said, I know a lot of people do put 30% away. I've decided to put 25% away for taxes simply because um, like when you do run a small business, you're be able to expense things from your business, right? So I feel like 25% would be more than enough for me to put away for taxes but as the time progresses if i feel like i need to put more away i will but right now for taxes i'm simply going to be putting 25 percent away so being said 25 percent of 405 dollars was actually like 101 dollars but of course you already know me i rounded it up to 105 so that's how much i'm going to be putting in into taxes so a hundred dollar bill right here and a five dollar bill um so i went ahead and already wrote the balance because i did this on my tiktok live as well so yeah, y'all, taxes is getting 105. And by the way, like I did not make these um, envelopes available on my website. Let me know if you want me to. Um, they will be available as digital downloads if you wanted to. But yeah, I just made them as like a silk theme. I don't know, I love silk, okay? Like a silk theme, so yeah, that's what it is. All right, y'all, so we're all done with taxes. Next, I'm going to move on to inventory, which is going to be getting $100 and i'm just gonna do two fifties like so so this is my first time like i mentioned um stuffing my business envelope which is exciting y'all so now our balance is now hundred dollars i wasn't sure if i wanted to incorporate this but you know what i'm like you know what i want you guys to see how i do go ahead into um dividing my small business income as well let me know if you want me to do more of these because usually i just stuff my nine to five income right so inventory is all stuffed so next we have savings so my business savings i decided to put in 115 um this is gonna come in handy y'all you know how it is when it comes to savings you never know what you need but for business savings i'm just keeping the money to the side just in case something were to come up and I were to be in need of extra funds. So 115 is the amount I'm going, I'm going to be stuffing. So we're gonna do a 50 to $20 bills, uh, to $10 bills, and then a five. So let's go ahead and count it up real quick. So we have 50, 70, 90, 100, and 10, 50. It's 115 is our balance. Boom, so we're all done. So let me just put it like this 115 so yeah savings is definitely a good category to have y'all when you have your business that way you have money put to the side if something were to come up i tried to go for like a nude theme so i kind of tried to do like different shades of brown and chocolate brown so that's what you're trying to see right here just shades of nude and browns so next we have yearly fees yearly fees y'all is not something that i'm too worried about like right now my domain is only 14 dollars a year um that being said like the amount I'm going to be saving up is not going to be a lot, but I'm going to be putting $5 to the side for yearly fees. So that's our current balance right now, $5. If anything were to come up, then I'll just go ahead and stuff accordingly. 
right now your late fees i'm simply saving for um my domain if there were any payments that i would have to make yearly then i will also take that into consideration but right now we're good with just the the domain in which i'm saving for so next we have supplies um supplies you guys already know y'all i do have a business fund within my sticky fund binder as well so in this case i'm not going to be stuffing a lot of money but i'm going to be adding a 20 dollar bill um this is going to come in handy you already know sometimes supplies i i do have to buy a few things here and there i'm going to be stuffing a 20 dollar bill for supplies and i still have the money surprisingly y'all i still have the money from my second fund from my previous cash stuffing that i have not depleted so that's good so right now we're sitting at like almost 50 dollars in supplies and i don't think i will be in need of anything anytime soon but of course it is good to have this available when i do need it so we're all done with supplies this is quick y'all so um next we have customs y'all i need to really get these albums going because i really want this to kind of match the flow of the rest so customs it's something that i should have thought about before but i completely forgot of course when you do buy things overseas you do get charged customs of course so i decided to start saving for it that way i don't have to be paying for it out of pocket so that being said customs i'm going to be adding 15 dollars. so we're just going to do a five and a ten so our balance is now 15 dollars so yeah because of course like when the first time i had to pay for customs i was not aware of that so now that i know i have to it's just going to help me prepare for that ahead of time so we're all done with customs next we have marketing there's a few things i'm learning y'all that i also want to start implementing that being said i'm just going to be putting candles towards marketing y'all don't mind my track i told y'all my um printer doesn't work right so right now i'm just gonna use what i have so it keeps everything in order for now so ten dollars for marketing and then giveaway i decided that for giveaway like usually what happens is i simply expense it from my pocket or like i simply go ahead and just take money from a buffer but it would be a good idea to plan ahead for giveaway as well that way i can really be clear as to what my budget is for giveaway um i do want to do a giveaway y'all once i do hit 2000 so yeah we shall see i'm contemplating a few different gifts i want to do something different so yeah giveaway is going to be getting ten dollars so our balance for giveaway is ten dollars i definitely need to go ahead and fix my printer because this is not it y'all <laughs> but yeah there we go so we're all done all right yeah, so we're all done with our business binder let me go ahead and close it up and we'll move to our sticky funds binder all right okay y'all so next we have our sticky funds binder remember i did mention i wasn't sure if i wanted to pay myself but you know what i told myself it would be a good idea for me to be stuffing a few categories here and there in which i thought needed to be bulked up and you know what it's motivational for me like at the end of the day y'all I always say you cannot save everything and truth be told even though i am very tempted to just reinvest fully into my business i do have to put myself first and also make sure i'm enjoying the journey so i'm going to be putting 25 dollars into my sticky funds and i've picked five categories in which i'm going to be stuffing five dollars each that i believe needs to be blocked up more than others but yeah let's go ahead and stuff our sticky fund binder next But let me know what you guys think about this whole um this whole thing i just mentioned like what do you think do you guys think it's a good idea would you rather just fully reinvest into your business or would you put some money towards yourself as well so um the first category that i'm going to be stuffing is salaka so i'm going to be putting five dollars towards giving so let's see right now we have 115 by adding five that should leave us with a balance of 120 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 105, 110, 115, 120. So 120 is our total. There we go. Wait, did I? Yeah, I put the five. Y'all, I I hear multitasking, thinking about so many things I have to get done. So we're all done with Salaka, so we're good to go. Let's go ahead and stuff this up. And then we're gonna move to our next category. I'm not going to be stuffing medical, y'all. I think I'm good. Um, emergency, I'm not going to stuff it either. I feel like it's 
doing good already with my nine to five. Carmina, I will be stuffing it because I feel like I'm a little bit behind. I do want to get three hundred dollars before the end of the year. Um, that's my goal for car maintenance. That being said, right now we're sitting at hundred and eighty-five. I'm going to be adding an additional five dollar bill that should bring me to hundred and ninety. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, 120, 130, 135, 140, 145, 150, 155, 160, 165, 170, 175, 180, 185, and 190. 190 dollars is our balance. So I am basically I'm going to need an additional 110. So 190 dollars. Oops, like that. Y'all, it's a little bit cold. Like my hands are like cold right now. Cause it's such a gloomy day outside right so there's an order in which i want to be releasing my videos um after this video i kind of want to do like a money mindset talk by the way y'all that's something else i wanted to talk about i know you guys mostly see me budgeting i uh, mostly see me um do my cash stuffings but i've decided that's something i've been trying to do for a long time but i've decided i was going to introduce money mindset talks which would have the purpose of elevating the way we see money the way we talk about money and simply our relationship towards money uh, in hopes of you know gaining a better relationship and then achieving better financial goals right so that's something i wanted to go ahead and implement let me know if you're interested let me know if you would like for me to include that into my channel because sometimes it's not only about the technical but it's also about the mental so I would definitely wanted to go ahead and include that let me know uh because i really want to but i don't know if you guys would be interested in having such videos or see, watching such videos so we're all done with car maintenance you already know that snowball's not getting nothing business i'm not gonna stuff it either because you already know it's kind of like double i have it in here and in my business folder gifts i'm good eat i'm good y'all self-care i'm good okay so next i want to go ahead and stuff technology Simply because um, technology is also one of these categories that simply added recently, not too long ago, so it does not have as much as the others. And for some reason, I don't know, y'all, I don't know how, but I always end up misplacing the trackers for some reason. But anyways, uh, tech is going to be getting an additional $5 bill, and I believe that's going to bring us up to $100, finally. So we have, let's go ahead and count it up. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. So we finally have $100 into our technology envelope. I'm excited. A little bit goes a long way, y'all. I know I always say this, but I'm excited because at first I'm like, mm. I wasn't too sure, you know. At first I was like hesitant because I'm like, it's going to take me a while. But you know what, y'all? Now we're like $100 in. A few more hundreds, God willing, and then we'll be able to get closer to our goal. If you don't know, I am trying to save for an iPad. You already know iPads are not cheap. So there we go. Next, I want to stuff travel. Trying to be outside. <laughs> so travel is going to be getting an additional $5 bill as well. That should bring us up to 110 So 20, 40, 60, 80, 105, 110. So 110 is our current balance for travel. Oh y'all, I got skin fingers, 110. There we go. So we're all done with travel. Y'all, school season is coming up. Oof, I don't know how I feel about that, but travel's all done. Support small is the next envelope I'm going to be stuffing. Again, I'm stuffing this envelope because it's a brand new one as well. So it doesn't really have much compared to the others. So I kind of want to go ahead and bulk it up. I'm going to be adding the last $5 bill. So we have five ten, so that gives us the balance of $15. Ooh, five dollars. Ooh, that's a weird five, y'all. Hmm. Scratch this whole thing. 15. <laughs> so 15 is our balance. I'm excited for support small. There's a few things I want to get from some Etsy shops. So yeah. Rollover does not get stuff, you already know. Buffer either. So we're all done. Let's go ahead and close this up. Oh, y'all. What a journey. What a journey. Okay, so I don't want to be talking too much, to be honest. Um, Because, yeah. I'm trying to really reassess the way I do my videos a little bit. I don't want you guys to be watching 
too long. I know you guys have things to do, so I'm trying to balance it out. But I always get excited that I get to come here and talk to you guys. I always look forward to it, so excuse me. But that being said, that's pretty much it. Again, today's video was different, so I hope you did enjoy it. Let me know in the comments if you did. Thank you so much, Brianna. I love, 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 love my cup. But yeah, y'all, thank you so much for tuning in. Let me know if you'd like for me to incorporate money in my side talks. Let me know if you want me to stuff more of my small business income. And if you did make it all the way till the end, we're still rocking this um, orange nails. You already know. So if you did make it all the way to the end, please leave me any type of orange emoji. I would really appreciate it. I really like how you guys come up with different emojis. So that's super exciting. And I'm like, oh, I didn't even know this emoji existed, you know? I saw like a, an orange yarn ball. So that was super exciting. Thank you so much for tuning in, y'all. As always, stay blessed. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye. Peace and love. Bye.